computer vision syndrome, otherwise known as athanopia, affects 90 million computer users worldwide every year. Symptoms of computer vision syndrome include sore, tired, burning or itching eyes, watery or dry eyes, blurred or double vision, headaches, neck, shoulder or back pain, increased sensitivity to light, difficulty concentrating and fatigue. All the previous symptoms can seriously decrease productivity of employees in the workplace. As health implications can be severe, the urgency for employers to minimise risk to their employees is now paramount. The World Health Organisation recognises athenopia and affiliated symptoms. This can be found in the International Statistical Classification of Diseases and Related Health Problems 10th Revision Chapter 7 under Visual Disturbances and Blindness, H53-54. to These symptoms can be prevented and even go into remission by optimising the user screen. Before looking at solutions, it's important to recognise how the eyes function in conjunction with suboptimal digital displays. We can assess these conditions using an eye movement tracker, which gives directional data and time against an XY axis for each eye individually, while a subject scans a short 10-line paragraph. Results for movement in healthy eyes should show identical results for both the left and right eye. Subjects with athenopia show a very different result. Typical cases will show subtle to severe variations between the left and right eye where eye movement is not synchronised. Examples of this can be viewed on the eye tracker results in the form of regression and other anomalies on the line reading. In many cases, the weaker eye will struggle to keep up with the more dominant eye. In this particular example, the less dominant eye can become weaker or lazier through repetitive use of digital displays. So how can digital displays be optimised to reduce these effects? Depending on the existing harmony between both eyes, altering the screen background colour can restore synchronicity between the left and right eye. Due to the extreme differences in eye health between digital users, optimal background colours will vary heavily between each person. Using a patented display screen optimizer, a user-specific background colour can be generated to reduce athenopia or computer vision syndrome. Without the need of an eye tracker, the reading speed of candidates is assessed while algorithms adjust background colour according to increases and decreases in the reading speed. The test lasts around 15 minutes, with typical increases in reading speed being reported as high as 20%. The test generates highly specific red, green and blue values, which can be programmed into the user's computer operating system. This can be completed in full, anywhere, and without the use of an eye movement tracker, making it accessible to any digital screen user at any location worldwide. The test will need to be repeated at regular intervals to trim and adjust users' background colours as binocular synchronisation improves. To verify the effectiveness of the digital screen optimizer, an eye movement tracker can be used as an advanced diagnostic tool to establish gains in binocular synchronisation and abnormalities in eye movement. Increased productivity by up to 20%. This equates to one extra day per employee based on a five-day working week. Comply with legislations. Contact Screen Risk and protect your workforce today.